suicide bomber termites. In the remote steamy forests of French Guiana lives a most unusual insect which goes by the name of Neocapritermes taracu. Termites are all fascinating creatures, unrelated to ants but living a similar lifestyle in sometimes vast underground colonies with a queen and worker castes specialising in different jobs. Unlike ants, however, termites are strictly vegetarian, feeding on all manner of plant materials and relying on symbiotic microbes in their guts to break down otherwise indigestible cellulose. Termites are the favourite food of many creatures from giant anteaters to ants themselves and they've evolved many different defences over the millennia, but none more committed than that of Neocapritermes taracu. As they become old, workers of this species develop blue spots in their abdomens, filled with copper-rich proteins. Over time, their jaws also wear out and become blunt, and they're limited use to the colony. But these workers become more aggressive and attack any intruder. If the fight isn't going well, the old workers burst and the blue proteins react with hydroquinones stored in the salivary glands of the now dead insect to form highly toxic benzoquinones, the same compounds that blast out of the bottoms of bombardier beetles. Scientists describe this behaviour as suicidal altruism, analogous to the barbed sting of worker honeybees, which results in the bee's death if it stings. In both cases, the worker is willing to nobly sacrifice itself for the greater good of its colony. Thank you.